Hello and welcome to the video by Trump Excel. I am Sumit Vansal and in this video I will show you how to use Network Days International function in Excel. Network Days International is a good function to use when you have a start date and an end date and you want to identify the number of working days between these two dates. This function also gives you the flexibility to uh, I specify the weekend so you can specify that Saturday Sundays are weekends so it would not count these weekends in your working days and within this function you also have the flexibility to specify some other days as weekends so if you're working in a geography say like Middle East then you would want to specify Friday and Saturdays as uh, weekends and uh, if you're at some other part of the world where weekends are something other than Saturday Sundays then you can specify that this function is a variation of a previous function uh, network days where you could do the same thing but the weekends were fixed you could only have Saturdays and Sundays as the weekends so here you get that flexibility so now let me show you how to use this function I type network days international and you can see it takes four arguments start date end date weekend and holidays so for this example let me simply use the start date and end date and I hit control enter and this gives me 71 because there are 71 working days between these two dates which is 1st March 2014 and 9th June 2014 and this does not include Saturdays and Sundays by default now let me show you a variation of this function so here I specify the same start date and end date and this gives me a drop down list where I can choose the weekends so I can specify that Saturday Sundays are weekends Sunday or Monday is a weekend Monday Tuesday and so on or I can specify single days only Sunday is a weekend so uh, a lot of people have six uh, days a week uh, working week so they can specify either Sunday only or Monday only or Tuesday only so this function gives you that flexibility in this case let me have uh, the first option selected which is Saturdays and Sundays and the last argument is number of holidays so if you have certain holidays either public holidays national holidays that occur between these two dates then you can select that entire range and those would not be counted and I hit control enter and this gives me 68 because there are 71 days between these two working uh, these two dates and there are three holidays if there is an overlap between a holiday and a weekend so for example uh, this holiday lies on a Saturday then the function does not double count it it would account for it now let me show you another variation of this function so I have the same start date end date and in this case I select Friday and Saturday as my weekend and I again select the number of holidays and I hit control enter and this gives me 70 the reason is that in now when I do this uh, in these number of dates I have changed the weekend so based on that it recalculates again and this gives me 70 because there are 70 working days between these two dates where it does not count Friday and Saturday and these holidays so this is how Network Days International Function works. I hope you found this useful. Thank you and have a nice day.